Okay, this is just a short demonstration of convection. It's using the typical kind of convection glassware. But in, up until now, I've always used potassium permanganate, which isn't the best chemical, a bit of a toxic chemical. So I read on a forum recently, you could use Indian ink, and the recommended dilution was five parts water to one part Indian ink. So that's pure Indian ink, but let's just have a look at five parts water to one part Indian ink. So I'm just gonna put the flame on and stick it where it needs to be. Right, okay, so I'll pipette some of the ink in. So it's just five parts water, one part Indian ink. There you go. So you can see that it's pretty visible going around the uh, glassware. I didn't put a huge amount in there, so you can really see the convection there. I was pretty impressed with that. It's better in real life than it is on the video there, to be honest. But you can see now it's going vertically as, uh, as the liquid's going around. But we can try it with a little bit, a bit more now. Try it with actually the full Indian ink. Okay, so this is undiluted now, okay? This one, it tends to become more globular, but it is quite visible. There you go. So I just put the pure Indian ink in there now. And you can really see it moving around, okay? It's very visible that way. But the recommendation was to use five parts water, one part Indian ink. I guess, because after a while, you get little bits sticking together here and uh, but that's pretty impressive demo and and it's a very easy clear up not like uh, potassium permanganate can be at times so that's uh using indian ink instead of potassium permanganate for the convection demo as you can see it's very visible very easy to see